2021 is the year of the ox, the 38th year in the traditional Chinese lunar calendar, also called the year of Xinchou. The ox ranks second in the 12 Chinese zodiac animals. China is an agrarian society, and the ox culture in China dates back for a long time. Ancient text Sun Jing writes, the horse, the ox, the sheep, the fowl, the dog, the pig. These six animals are those which men keep. These six types of animals, collectively known as head of domestic animals, have been cherished by the Chinese people for centuries. China has a long history of raising cattle, and cattle have been closely related to the lives of working people. According to legend, Emperor Yan worshipped the cattle totem and invented agriculture, and was henceforth referred to as God of Agriculture. The ferocious trio, a subordinate in the tribe of Emperor Yan, also worshipped the cattle totem and became a god of war in Chinese legends. In the folk legend, the cowherd and the weaver girl, often hailed as China's Romeo and Juliet. The weaver girl, a deity from heaven, fell in love with the cowherd, a diligent, down-to-earth and faithful mortal. After forced separation, the cowherd continued to love the weaver girl, even though they could meet only once a year on the Mackey Bridge. The honest and loyal personality of the cowherd was accentuated in the story and the star-crossed lovers' affection towards one another elucidated the yearning for a better life by the Chinese working people. The bull's masculine qualities have made it a key symbol in many ancient cultures. Since prehistoric times, the symbolism of the bull has been associated with power and male fertility, and the bull itself has been the object of many religious rituals. Hindus do not eat beef because the hard-working bull once assisted men in farming along the sacred Ganges River. Egyptian pharaohs regarded the bull as a deity and often portrayed it as a sun god in their paintings and sculptures. There are many Chinese expressions using the character for bull, such as strength of nine oxen and two tigers, a metaphor for great strength, tall as an ox and large as a horse, used to describe someone's physical size, playing the harp to a bowl, an analogy for wasting one's breath, and to take the bowl by the horns, an expression for stubbornness. However, there's nothing simpler than using the character bowl to praise a person's confidence. There are many words and expressions regarding the bowl in English too. A continual rise in stock market prices is called a bull market, since bulls symbolize production and profit. The word cow is often used to describe stubbornness and headstrong, such as have a cow, a slang for throwing a fit. A bull in a china shop, which describes a careless person, or bull taming, which means with determination one can even overpower primordial forces. The bull is also a token for sturdiness. The iron bulls of the Yellow River, built on 725 AD during the Tang Dynasty, used their weights and footings on the ground to anchor and support the Kuching floating bridge, an artery for logistics at the time. The infrastructure cost 1,100 tons of iron, equivalent to four-fifths of China's iron production that year. It is more than appropriate to describe the iron statues, which are great in size and even greater in responsibility with the Chinese term like a bow with a heavy load. The ox, a grounded, humble, and hard-working animal, has deeply influenced the lives of the Chinese people for generations. 2020 was a difficult year. As the year of the ox approaches, we hope everyone can be blessed with many more new opportunities. Happy Year of the Ox!